first thing you're going to want to do is go to forescan.org and download the Windows program um, or download Wine if you know what that is. Then while you're installing it, you'll want to go to the forum, join the forum, and go to general and support, standard and extended license, and you want to install it first because you'll need to get your hardware ID, and you get that by going down to this button here, and copy the clipboard and go down to generate trial license log in then you'll put in your information generate key then download after it's downloaded you'll go back to where you generated or where you copied your hardware ID and you'll just load license just now in Forescan just go and hit the connect button um, it'll ask you what year your vehicle is uh, mine's 2016 model year For me, I know everything's connected once it gets down to the driver's seat module and driver's door module. Uh, here we'll show you some some codes that have popped up that, that don't show a check engine light but show issues that have happened. Probably just like disconnected for some reason, like Bluetooth sometimes disconnects. Uh, here you got some... Uh, view parameters lets you see exactly what things are doing. Here you can run self tests. Look at the log. Uh, reset the modules. Here's the the part I like the most. Uh, most people like the most, probably. Uh, here you can, as built format, just shows you the hexadecimal of what you can change. And then if you go down to the one that doesn't say as built, then that has stuff usually that's already been um, found out. Like this is the driver belt reminder status. I can drive without having to have my seat belt on, which I think is pretty awesome. Not that I do it, it's just, you know, you can take it off, leave it off for a little bit for whatever reason, and then put it back on whenever you want. Uh, and that's it. If you have any other questions, just leave a comment.